Hi guys, Mark here and welcome to lesson number two of a 10 part crash course on guitar techniques and how to play the guitar. And today we're going to be going through picking with your picking hand and for most people that's the right hand, obviously if you're left handed, if you want to turn around and it's your left hand. Right. Okay, so in the first lesson we, we went through um, fretting and then on this lesson we're going to go through the picking. I'm going to give you a quick zoom up of my picking area so then you can see very, very clearly what we're going to be doing. Okay, so here we are down at my picking area. Right, as you can see, this is the correct stance, hopefully. All right. Now what I've got here, I've got a couple of fingers, my little finger and my third finger, if, if you want to use your second finger at the same, same time. But you put them on a pickup or a point within, within the guitar that you can keep anchored to. All right. And that's going to pretty much stay there whenever we play single string solos and things like that. Okay? When you strum, you take that away and you strum up and down like this. When you are picking single strings, if you can get into the habit of putting a couple of fingers there, it really does support your hand and it also helps you identify where the strings are without having to constantly look down at where the strings are. Okay? It just makes sense. Right, so a little exercise that you can do. All right? You just cover your strings up like this. So they're muted, okay? And then we do alternate picking, all right? So like this, your bottom string, this one, bottom E string, that one there. If you use your pick and do a down pick on that, okay? And then follow it with a complete opposite, which is an up pick, like that. So down, up. So we do one of those on each of the strings. Down, up, fifth string, down, up, fourth string, down, up, third string, down, up. Second string down up, first string down up, and come back down again. Yeah, warts and all. Okay guys, so thanks for watching that, um, a very quick intro to it and that should help you on your way to picking accurately, effectively and using alternate picking which will really save you time later on when you're learning really complex guitar solos and it really helps you play faster and more fluently. I'll see you guys in lesson number three and mark out for now, don't forget to subscribe and go to www.randallsomeguitar.webs.com for some more videos. Bye bye for now. Thank you.